another tough day? I know. Share your mind with me for a moment and let's get you better. My people, hear my secret. When frustrated, look to those who won't speak for guidance. It's based on the words of a Zen proverb. To be calm is the highest achievement of the self. Here's the storytelling. Friends say I push them away when they are trying to help. To be calm is the highest achievement of the self. I needed alone time to think and figure things out for myself. Once I had my own mind straight on how I needed to handle the situation, I was able to listen to another's perspective. The character trait that I improved was self-realization and now the mindset. Ever notice that when you're frustrated, everyone wants to give a hand? Whether it's a big or simple problem, people just seem to feel it and everyone wants to help by giving you their opinion. Everyone that is, except for that one quiet person in the corner who seems to ignore all the commotion. Everyone asks, what's wrong? Tell us, we can help. But the quiet one in the corner looks up. Your eyes meet briefly, but then the person returns so methodically to the task that they were doing as you are barely existing. The others, however, continue the barrage. I can help you, she says. There's nothing I haven't faced, says another. For me, I ask myself, why am I so eager to hear the opinion of others? Am I looking for someone to pat me on the back? Pet me? To make me feel better? I find that in these situations, I need to remain calm, maintain my mental balance first, while guarding my feelings. I've also found that if I accept the opinion of another, I had better be prepared for an ensuing argument if I don't take their suggestion and follow it to a T. So I kindly thank them for their offer to help and let them know that I need to figure it out on my own. As Marcus Aurelius once said, I need to retreat into myself. And what about that quiet person in the corner, you ask? As my dialogue with the others have come to a close, the person in the corner again looks over at me, but this time with a strong presence in their eye. They smile, nod their head in agreement, and give me that genuine look of approval. You see, that's my trusted friend. They know I need to figure this out for myself. They're always there to listen, but unlike the others, will not speak unless asked. Thank you for sharing your mind with me. For your continued success, hear my secret. When frustrated, look to those who won't speak for guidance. Now relax and be as you wish to seem empowered. I'm Lori Stith, the Stoicist, and I believe in you.